Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here today with Bandit and Rich and what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Bandit's ability to understand and respond to his formal on-leash obedience commands. The little tiny corrections and lots of motivation that we give the puppies when we're working with them and the training equipment that we're using. Rich is using a regular six foot web training leash. He keeps the bulk of the leash folded neatly in his right hand which leaves his left hand free to act as a steering wheel or a way to give a possible adjustment or correction. Now Bandit loves his little blanket out here and he is laying down very nicely, but the first exercise that we're gonna be demonstrating for you is healing. Healing is proper leash walking and the command is bandit heal. Now healing is different than going outside to go potty and because you have to leash walk this boy to go to the bathroom, he has to be allowed to sniff when he's going potty, but not to sniff when you're going for a walk. So healing is leash walking we're going for a walk we're getting exercise you don't have to go potty so then we expect him to keep his head up off the ground and when you stop to cross traffic or talk to someone on the street he should sit and rich is using a clicker and an occasional treat which we will send a clicker home for you He's trying to get to his blanket, which he loves. Nice sit. Stay. This is your sit stay command. And Scott, you're not a novice with this. Same commands that Buster and Rocky learned, Bandit has learned, and this is your sit stay. It's a hand and voice command. When Rich returns back to him, he walks back to his shoulders. He gives him a click for a good job, and they take off healing again. Nice set. Good job. Now that is the place where we have taught him to lay down and stay. So he gets on the blanket and lays down. You can use a dog bed, a little mat, a blanket, anything that you have that's going to be for him, for his place. He doesn't want to get up. This is your come command and he comes and sits. We're kind of in the shade. We'll do it again in the sun. So you can have him sit or lay down. That's your down stay. And the only problem with Bandit and his down stays is once you get him down, he doesn't want to get up. This is your come command. He should come and sit. Now come and launch himself on you. So we have demonstrated for you his ability to heal, to sit automatically when you stop, to sit and stay, to lay down on his place and stay, to come. I'm going to be sending you home some reading material that you can forward to your dog walkers, to anybody who interacts with him. You're going to get your video this afternoon so that you can see what he's learned and you can practice along with the video. I'm going to send you a sample schedule. Lots of information to make this transition back to home as seamless as possible. He's been with us for a long time. He is definitely on our routine. So I would suggest that if you're going to change his routine very much, you change it slowly. We have gotten attached to him. He, he has been a time-consuming little project, but he's adorable, he's loving, he's sweet, he's cute. And we want to thank you again for using us here at Nora's Dog Training Company. If you have any questions, please reach out, and we will see you soon.